good day to all of you this uh, video is about the transcription factors the transcription factors are the transacting soluble proteins that controls the rate of the transcription of a genetic information from dna to the mrna by binding to a specific dna sequence so these transcription factors binds to the promoter or the enhancer side of the dna and these are needed for the transcription initiation so basically there are three groups of the transcription factor that is basal transcription factors or called as the general transcription factors the upstream uh, or the activators and the third one is the regulatory transcription factors so basal transcription factors are the class of the protein transcription factors that binds to a specific site or the promoter site on dna to active transcription of genetic information from dna to the mrna so general transcription factors are decategorized into the following types that is transcription factor uh, 2a transcription factor 2b transcription factor 2d uh, which uh, is subdivided into tata binding pro binding pro protein and the tata binding protein associated factors fifth uh, fourth one is the tra uh, transcription factor 2e 2f uh, which is subdivided into rap 74 and rap 38 and the transcription factor 2h and 2j so here is the figure of the general transcription factor of pre-initiation complex so second one is the upstream transcription factor or the activator which increase the transcription of a gene or set of genes and are responsible for the maintaining the speed or the base of the transcription so it is subdivided into some units like uh, sp1 CTF family, CPI family, which binds to the CAAT box in the fibrinogen gene and has a different factors. C or EBP, it refers the CAT box uh, with the sequence of GCAAT. And for fifth one is the ACF, it also binds to the usual CAAT sequence and the albumin promoter, OCT1, OCT2, which found in the lymphoid, uh, lymphoid cells and is a tissue specific octobal binding factor. So figure this uh, shows the enhancer side promoter side and the activator binds to the general transcription factor so last one is the regulatory transcription factor which just like the upstream transcription factor but it has a somehow certain regulatory role also so they are classified into two groups based on the distance from the start side that is proximal promoter size ppe or the long range regulatory element that is l r r e so this is all whole about the transcription factors and their subtypes. Keep watching. Thank you.